When I was 19, I finally asked myself if I was gay, and the answer was terrifying. The only other people who'd grown up at my evangelical church in Kansas who'd come out had left, and it was like they'd been erased from the community. In my church, as in so many others, being gay and Christian wasn't an option. But I couldn't give up on my faith. I didn't want to lose my family or church either. So I left school to study the central question so many gay Christians face. How could I reconcile my sexual orientation with what the Bible says about same-sex relations? This book answers that question. It's the culmination of four years of research, synthesizing for a popular audience the key insights of biblical scholars about the six references in scripture to same-sex behavior. It's also a personal story, describing how my study of those passages changed my dad's mind about same-sex relationships. And more than that, it's a blueprint for how other Christians can come to affirm same-sex marriage while also affirming their commitment to the full authority of the Bible. God and the Gay Christian is a book for gay Christians and their supporters who want to make a difference in the church. It's for their family members and other Christians who feel like they can't support LGBT people and stay true to the Bible. And it's for those outside the church who want to dialogue respectfully and persuasively with Christians who oppose marriage equality. At its core, this book is about building a future in which all Christians come to affirm their LGBT brothers and sisters and where no one ever has to have that realization be terrifying again.